All right, guys, so back with part two of this organoid experiment. So here we've got some wild rocket lettuce, and within there is a piece of organoid, and I'll show you that in a while. But um, here I've got lined up three um, of them, exactly the same, so wild rocket. Now, if you haven't seen my first video, go watch that, because these, um, these plants, weeds, whatever you want to call, call them, were in a different state. So it's been a little bit more time has passed, so I've chosen to do the video. So what this is... <laughs> is you can see this organite that's within here. Now it's been in there for, I'll say, um, a month and a half. Now, I should have done this video earlier. Um, yeah, but um, it is what it is. Okay, so you can see how green this is. You've seen how sort of full it is, how green it is. And then you go to this one. All right, so this one here, when I put that organite in, in this one, it uh, was half the size of this. Right, so this here hasn't grown uh, much bigger at all. Um, and it's not very thick at all. Like, it's very thin sort of at the base. You can see a lot of, you know, you can see through through it there and it's not very healthy. Uh, it's nowhere near as green where you go to this and it is and it's full. Uh, not only that, they do feel a lot different. They feel a lot more lush um, leaves, a lot more supple, a lot more moisture in them. Um, it's the only one out of the three with a flower left. All right. Now I should have done this earlier, like I said, because this thing was loaded up with um, flowers. It had little buds all over it. Um, yeah, compared to the other two. So not only that, you can see it's starting to grow like some nice grass sort of in the area around it, where that is not. All right. So I'll go over to the right here. Now this one here out of the three was the biggest. All right, and it's sort of in the same state as the one on the far left without the organite. Now you can see straight through to the bottom, the base there, there's no, it's not very thick at all. It's very thin on it and not very green, not as healthy looking as the one with the organite. So ignore this monster of a, a weed um, in the background there, which is, uh, this here is part of it here. That's not part of it. So this is what we're looking at, the wild rocket lettuce. So you can see that. Come back over here, you can see this one. All right, so very green. And yeah, it's just growing so much more healthier, so much more stronger. All right. Yeah, I can't, I'm kind of a little bit, yeah, this stuff works. All right. So I'll get the organite out and I'll show you what it actually is. So, and to be fair as well, when I put this one, because it was, I wanted to give this to the underdog. So that's why I give it to the smaller one. Because if this stuff is going to have an effect, like I want to see it and I'm seeing it. So when I did do that, it already had some broken limbs. Like this here is broken. This one here is broken here as well and a, and a bit of damage due to the fact that i was probably walking on it you know come out and hang the clothes up i was probably walking on this and uh so i chose to put this one here so this is the very first one that i made in here is uh copper brass and aluminium powder it's got a copper coil the sbb coil and it's got selenite kyanite and there is clear quartz in there so that's what's been living in there for a little while you know and uh yeah i could have done this a lot a uh, movie or well, video a little bit earlier because you could definitely see um, the big health difference between them and this one had a lot more flowers and yeah you can see it's starting to grow nice green grass around it where this isn't and it's just nowhere near as healthy you, I mean you can see that right guys you know you can see this alright so that's all I've done and um, that's it that's all I've got to say I think this stuff works so the reason why it works in case you want to know, in my research, because I research this a lot, right? So, organite creates energy, creates these scalar waves, zero point energy, um, organ energy, chi, mana, prana, consciousness, life force, energy. It's all the same thing. So, these here create that. They pull in, they can pull in the, um, the DOR, which is the deadly organ energy or the bad energy, the stagnant energy energy from EMFs, and they convert it into good, healthy POR, positive organ, which is healing and beneficial for all things living. All right, so plants are... So in my research, I've found out that plants can be energy to matter converters. So they take energy, good energy, and they convert it into matter, into their leaves, into their fruit, into their uh, whatever to be healthier. And we as humans, we're the opposite to that. All right, so we're matter to energy converters. We take food, we take fruit, we take vegetables, we eat it and turn it into energy, so we're the opposite. So, and with that in mind, uh, plants can actually have uh, need less water. They don't need as much water as you think if they've got the right amount of energy. And um, 
yeah, they're just in a healthier environment, which is what these are. Everything is energy. All right. So, um, guys, thanks for watching. So there's some evidence, some proof compared to what's going on over here and on the far right. But you can clearly see what's going on here, and this is due to this. All right, guys, so thanks for watching. And I'll do um, more videos like this in the future. I'll do more experiments um, just to prove more of a point. From what I've seen, this stuff works, okay? Thanks for watching, guys.